press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. Six months back, French government initiated talks with India for the possible sale of 31 retired Jaguar deep strike aircraft to the Indian Air Force. Stored Jaguar will be used for spares and parts, and the Indian Air Force does not intend to make them operational again. The Indian Air Force intends to keep its Jaguar deep strike aircraft operational till 2034. India will require many parts of the airframe, which gets replaced with time. Reportedly, French have also made an interesting offer on possible sale of Mirage 2000 to India. France has offered India 40 Mirage 2000s, which were retired. It's not clear if the French offer is for the off-stored Mirage 2000, which were replaced by Rafale fighter jet and can be put back to operational service, or it was to be used for spares to support India's Mirage 2000 fleet, which will remain operational till 2040. Meanwhile, India will receive the first six Rafale aircrafts in September 2019, and delivery of all 36 fighters will be completed by the end of 2022. Dassault Aviation will also make specific changes for India and mount new generation Meteor and Scalp missiles. Meteor is the next generation, beyond visual range, air-to-air -air missile system, which offers multi-shot capability against long-range, maneuvering targets with a range in excess of 100 km. Whereas the Scalp missile is capable of engaging targets precisely in any weather conditions during day and night. The twin-jet multi-role air superiority fighter, Su-30, is developed by Russia's Shukhoi and built under license by India's Hindustan Aeronautics Limited. Russia has offered to upgrade India's Su-30 fleet to make it very close to the fifth-generation fighter, but India has asked for time to evaluate its strategy. On the sidelines of International Air Show in Moscow, Rostock's Director of International Cooperation, Viktor N. Kladov, has said that Russia had made the offer for upgradation of the Su-30 during last month's meeting between Russian President Vladimir Putin and Prime Minister Modi. Su-30 will be very close to the fifth-generation aircraft in capabilities, as it will be a deep modernization, and parts, like engine, computers, and radar, will all be changed. The upgraded Super Shukhoi's will include a modernized cockpit. A major part of the upgrade also involves avionics and sensors, and will be equipped with BrahMos, the Indo-Russian supersonic cruise missile, and infrared homing system. Six advanced submarines to be built under Project 75I for the Indian Navy to scale up its warfare capabilities has moved to the crucial next stage with the request for information to six foreign original equipment manufacturers for the 8.3 billion euros submarine project. A surprise contender among the six manufacturers is Japan's leading shipbuilders, Mitsubishi Heavy Industries and Kawasaki Heavy Industries, which have been strongly promoting their technological prowess to win contracts to build India's next generation of submarines. Sources added that though the basic parameters of importance in the request for information was the air-independent propulsion systems, which enables the submarine to stay submerged for longer durations and substantially increase their operational range. The manufacturers were asked to submit data on the proposed design for torpedo tubes. Details were also sought on the means to increase the submarine's endurance and stealth capability, anti-surface an anti-submarine warfare capability and land attack capability.